Hi, my lovely Leos. How is everybody? This is going to be a full moon, um, the beaver full moon on the 27th. This is going to be a full moon reading. What messages need to come through for you guys? Make sure you're watching your moon sign reading also, because there will always be messages within your moon sign during like a full moon, new moon, um, lunar, solar eclipse. I always say to watch your rising moon and Venus placement readings anyway, because there will be messages within those readings that bring you clarity to what is here, um, you know, within your sun sign reading. So do take what resonates. I'm giving away two free personal readings for the month of November. For those of you that are new, I'm so grateful you're here. I do these monthly giveaways as a way of giving back for the amazing journey here. So by subscribing, you can take part in the monthly giveaways. And then for this month, leave a leaf emoji in the comment section of each reading that you view of mine from now until the end of the month. So you got you know a good week to still get in the leaf emoji. At the end of the month, I'll remind everybody to be t checking their notifications, which is the little bell at the top right hand corner of everybody's home page of YouTube because two people will be hearing back from me and then I will announce the special for December. All right, for my news, nothing will come of this situation. Void of course moon. I feel that faint amethyst energy in the distance, if you can see it right here. This moon is completely bright. There's nothing shading the moon. So I still feel that there's going to be growth or a path is going to be illuminated for you. Conclusion, yeah, conclusions are within reach. Something, there's going to be clarity received here. An opportunity. For my Leos. All right, we got, yeah, see? Something that, a goal that you've set for yourself. Something that you've been desiring to achieve for yourself. Progress is positive and personal. Something you're achieving. It's almost like a solution. Like, again, a solution is in reach. A new beginning is about to begin for you. You're about to soar and take that leap of faith. You're soaring towards your destiny, Leo. You've got that strength. You've learned those hard lessons. And the sun is about to shine. All right, let's see where this is going to be at. It's going to be different for what you know you've set for each and every one of you. Can you please bring me additional clarity for this full moon in Leo spirit? Full moon in Leo. Look, happiness is in reach. Love here. Pisces energy with this card. Affection and appreciation. Could be platonic, could be romantic. I definitely feel unconditional love here for you, Leo. Who are you missing? Who are you feeling, you know, heartbreak with? Remember, a solution is within reach. I'm getting air energy with that eagle there, but I also have Pisces, Taurus, Gemini. All right, let's see. Yeah, look at that. Road blockage, but do you see how it's starting to, it, it, like, you still can get by on this one side? I feel a pause between you and someone, but it, it was really a chance for you to both regroup. And there will be a balancing of scales. Libra energy. Capricorn also energy we have that I didn't mention. A solution is in reach, Leo. 
Let's see. Something big is happening during this full moon energy for you. And I don't, I, I truly don't feel that you see this coming. Ten of Wands. Yeah, see, it's been like an uphill battle. It might have been a sudden ending that, you know, you weren't expecting, nor did you want. You feel almost like time is running out. But there's that leap of faith taken. The fool twice here. Seven of swords. Yeah, somebody wants to come clean. I feel somebody was holding back their feelings and emotions for you. Please clarify the Ten of Wands, the Fool, and the Seven of Swords Spirit. Three of Wands. The Eight of Swords. I got to tell you, I feel... For most of you, it's going to be an air energy, but take the signs that I did mention so far. I feel an air sign has held back from you. Felt stuck within their own mind space. But it's like you stole their heart. I feel in terms of emotions, they held back. They wanted to control or put their sword up and protect themselves, control how much of themselves they really allowed in or opened up to you about how they were feeling. I do feel a distance here. So you could be a different state, different country, away from one another. But I do feel that they are heart heavily thinking about you. It's like they're going to pick a path to communicate with you and keep their fingers crossed. Yeah. In this time apart from you, Leo, it's given them a lot of time to think. Yeah, see, so you're not going to expect this coming. You thought this was completely over, and I feel like it was really hard for you. This ending with this person. Cross watchers, take it how it resonates. You might have to flip it. Yeah, Leo, you've been hard at work on yourself, your goals, things that you want to accomplish. But you've got the golden touch. This person cannot stop thinking about you. The Six of Swords. There's the traveling. And they're coming in quick. No more blockage, remember? No more of the blockage. No more stalemate energy. They are closing out cycles within their life. Things that, you know, they were overthinking. It could have been they were very triggered when they had such strong feelings for you. But now they're coming towards you wanting emotional happiness, wanting long term. And this is karma in your favor. Like I said, you continued on. I feel like you did show up in this connection. You showed up. When there was an ending, you continued on. You continued planting those seeds, reaching goals, as going through, like aspiring for what you want in your future. All along, they've been thinking about you. They're making their plan to come forward. Are you ready? I feel like it's always been a plan within their mind. 
but it was actually the fear of moving forward. But now they're letting go of that fear. Right, like I said, like a path is about to be illuminated. This is karma in your favor. It's also divinely orchestrated too. I love this. Yeah, they are hot for you. And they are going to take that leap of faith. And like I said, I feel it's very unexpected when you look down at your phone and you see either that they're calling or that they're texting you. All right. Let's see, Leo. We have S, A, B, F, O, U, E, W, R, a lot of A's, P, D, and the rest are repeats. T. Sorry, guys. Rest are repeats. Let me know how it resonates. Leave that leaf emoji down below. Anytime you want me to tune in to just your energy, Leo, to bring you clarity, guidance, whatever you're going through, the link to my Etsy shop is in the description box. You can head over there anytime you want to check it out. So much love and light, guys. Have a great, um, you know, full moon energy. Happy holidays, because for all of us who do celebrate, we're embarking on the beginning of the holiday season, and I will be back for many more readings.